Good morning, everybody. It is October 2nd, 2023, and I am here at beautiful Summit Automotive Jeep in Fond du Lac, Wisconsin, right off Highway 41. We got the trucks on 41, the Jeeps on 41. You cannot miss us if you're traveling down 41 in Wisconsin going through Fond du Lac. We're right on the west side here. Anyways, um, October 2nd, we're starting off the month. We got some really nice inventory that came in. Uh, we were closed yesterday, uh, so this is the first day of the month for us. I, I was here yesterday, booked all these in, booked in a bunch of new cars that we got in, and uh, just uh, got to keep it rolling, you know. We had a really good month for October, uh, so a lot of used cars, over 107 or something like that, and then uh, new cars was pretty good too, so I hope everybody's uh, month was strong and starting off October right. Typically one of the slower months in uh, the car business, so we're going to try and keep it rolling with all this fresh inventory and hopefully we can uh, keep it going here. So uh, grab your coffee, let's go. Also all these vehicles will be linked in the description below on YouTube uh, to our current inventory. We're going to get these all pictured today. Um, worked hard last week so that we can get caught up on this stuff. So let's get going and uh, hope you enjoy the video. All right, starting off here, we have a 2020 Chrysler Pacifica. This one has 39,000 miles. This is a Touring L. It's got the quads, um, stow and go, blind spot monitoring. It's got the roof rack. This is an S appearance package. Red velvet is the color and it's got 39,000 miles on it. Now it's got Michelin tires uh, and it's really clean. I didn't see any dents on it and it's a, I believe it's a one owner from Minnesota. Anyways, super clean on the outside. Uh, really a nice ride. So we're gonna get that cleaned up today. Right here, I've got a 2022 Chevy Tahoe RST. Isn't that thing good looking? Two-tone with the black on top. Uh, this one has 31,000 miles on it. You get the 22 inch wheels with the RST package. Uh, this one's got the towing package and really a sharp ride. I think it's got the quads in it, second row bucket seats. And uh, next up, I've got a 2020 GMC Sierra 1500. This is an AT4. This thing is really clean too. This one has a little bit more miles, 53,000 miles. It looks big for a 1500. I actually thought it was a 2500 when I was booking it in yesterday, but it's actually a 1500. Um, 10 speed auto 5.3 liter it's got the multi pro tailgate and other than a little ding on this truck on the tailgate this thing's in immaculate shape speaking of immaculate shape i've got a 2021 ram 3500 here this is a bighorn level a so it's kind of the uh, base bighorn package i do like the wheels on it these uh, wheel simulators look really good uh, they almost look like the polished aluminums but um they're just simulators. Either way, they look really good. This one's got some really cool interior. It's like a light tan, almost brown. I know it's a little bit, got a lot of dew on everything this morning, but you can see that tan interior. And this one has 46,000 miles. This is also an Ison heavy duty transmission. It's got the high output Cummins diesel. Uh, this one has a 30,000 pound factory fifth wheel in it so it's uh ready to tow anything right here we've got a really nice trade-in this is a 2020 ford f-250 xl so it's the work truck but it is absolutely perfect i didn't see a dent on it and uh, it's got a utility box now this is a reading utility box series two it's got three storage cabinets on each side the classic two reading utility box looks like this one's out of pennsylvania but it was a trade uh, they bought a big uh, dump truck from us and this was their trade-in so uh, really a nice trade here is a 2021 ram 1500 laramie night edition this was also a trade-in they traded this in on a brand new truck and this thing is really nice this is a laramie level two it's got the heated cooled seats the 12 inch radio the night edition with the 22 inch wheels and i didn't see any dents on this one really nice condition as well billet silver is the color on this one if you're curious and this one's got 49,000 miles on it so almost 50,000 miles and it's still 
looks pretty much brand new and we'll be getting that in today as well here is a 2021 jeep grand cherokee this was also a trade-in and this was a trade-in on a brand new jeep I'm guessing they probably bought a red one usually when people buy these they stick with the same color and options this is a laredo so it's kind of the entry level uh, package it's a four by four and this one has 27,000 miles on it and is pretty much mint now if you're looking for a inexpensive half ton truck look no further than this one this is a 2014 toyota tundra sr5 crew max so it's got the big doors the alloy wheels it's in really nice condition considering this one has 157,000 miles on it yeah look at this truck 157,000 miles i mean the frames barely got any corrosion on or anything i mean 157,000 miles crazy drop in bed liner it's pretty clean inside we got to probably scrub the seats and stuff but other than that it's got the tow package all ready to go and uh, with 157,000 miles i'm sure it's going to be a really good deal and lastly i've got a 2019 challenger that came in trade can you guess what they bought you'll never guess this guy traded this in on an f-350 super cab long box dually power stroke diesel <laughs> They traded in his Challenger, but this is a really cool car. This is an RT. It's got the plus package. It also has the TA, which stands for Trans Am, and it's a scat pack, so it's got the 6.4 Hemi in it, and uh, it's got automatic transmission. It's got the 8.4 radio with factory navigation system. It's also got the dynamics package, uh, and it also has the active dampening system on it so it's kind of a loaded up challenger plum crazy purple of course and then it's got the satin finish wrap on the trunk roof and hood and then it's got the mopar um, hood pin package so that came right from the factory like that really a cool car and uh, that's that's really it that's all we got in over the weekend uh, there was a big lifted chevy that my guy grabbed already to start working on and then another ram half ton uh quad cab bighorn level two that my other guy grabbed to start cleaning because we got to get them going we got to keep everything rolling we got to pump up our inventory you know selling 100 some vehicles every month you got to replenish those with new vehicles so these are all the ones that either new trucks that got to get parked yet or these are some trade-ins from last week that we just didn't get to and i apologize for not doing a lot walk last week but i had a guy on vacation and i had a lot of his duties if you remember this truck this is the one that we had to pressure wash the frame was just horrendous on it we also put some new tires on it and uh looks a little bit better now this was the one that was from uh i think it was idaho or something but they brought it the entire state back with it but it looks really good now and now we just got to get it cleaned up and on the lot here. But anyways, that's the lot walk. As always, if you want me to do something different, you want to see something else, you want me to explain something more on the vehicles. Oh yeah, this uh, F-250, that's got the 6.2 in it, uh, V8. So anyways, hope everybody has a great October, start to October, and I uh, had a good uh, finish to September. Thanks again for checking out the video. And uh, check these all out at, in the description below or at summitauto.com. Thanks again and have a great day and let's get at it.